So second address. Chapter 10. In the Apocrypha, which these devils hit the, hit the Apocrypha because they know the judgment was in the Apocrypha. But all the nation's judgment was in the Apocrypha because the prophecies was in the Apocrypha, was in the Apocrypha as he was telling Edris. Literally, Edris is in a bush and then the Lord was speaking to Edris. You have to keep it a secret. All right. It says, Book of Second Edris, chapter 10, verse 59. And so shall the highest show thee visions. Okay, okay, what the prophets prophets represent? We represent the visions of the heavenly father and his only begotten son. Okay, visions of the high things which the most high will do unto them that dwell upon the earth in the last days. And we are in the last days, we are in the uh, the uh, the 12th hour, man. Okay, and so I slept that night, and another light as the uh, another like as he commanded me. Okay. Showing Ezra's of uh, the visions that are about to take place upon upon uh, Basra, all right, or throughout the earth also, you know, because it's going to get so bad out here. You got lack of food, okay. Your your your, your fat poor eat, eating wife ain't going to get that 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 same uh, uh ham again. She's going to be fighting for a ham. Literally, she's going to be like a hungry hungry hippo fighting over the, fighting the other hippo for the last lamb chop in uh, I mean the, for the last pork chop man in in, in, the, in the supermarket. All right. That's why this Lord said, um, um, in Isaiah, you know, in Isaiah four and one, that um, said women shall take a hold of one man because you women are horrendous, man, out of order. Okay, y'all wanna uh, y'all wanna do manly jobs, you know. Y'all wanna uh, curse out your children. All right. Y'all wanna uh, over be obese. This is a obese nation. Okay. The Lord fattening y'all up for the slaughter, you know. Y'all like y'all looking like um, y'all looking like uh, uh uh you know overloaded cow and chickens, man. Okay. Um. I'm gonna try to wrap it up. Go to Proverbs 12 and script There's Psalms 86 and and 6 give ear O Yahweh unto my prayer and attend to the voice of my supplication and the day of my trouble I will call upon thee for thou wilt answer me okay when we call upon in what the name of Yahweh by Shimei and Shai, he's gonna answer us give unto prayer okay you know because these people don't have connections to the Lord man we the prophets do the elect nation of Israel have uh, connections to the connection to the heavenly Father's only begotten Son. Okay. Um. Wow. What I was gonna get. Proverbs twelve and five. The water. The thoughts of the righteous are right, but the counsels of the wicked are deceit. They uh, uh, pushing that media about uh, the Maxine. They pushing the media about their. Uh, they're going to be soon pushing the media about their microchips. Okay, they pushing the media about uh, the, the horizon of of, of um, all hell about to break loose and then uh, about to bring forth military troops. Okay, that's their deceit. And we, the prophets, on the corner is telling the right things on how to live. Okay, oh, by way of the scriptures, man. Okay, we give you, we giving you, we giving you a cup of waters of your when you're thirsty. 
We giving you food when you're hungry. Okay? Come eat this lamb dinner. You know? Um, wow, I'm going to wrap it up. It's getting real cold out here. So we're gonna end it with Luke, all right? And then missile's gonna fly and hit this place, man. Okay. Um, let me see if I can get it. We're gonna end it with Luke. But before that, you know, we gotta get the uh, we gotta get uh, Revelations 13 and 16. Cause that's the ultimate prophecy that's gonna come to pass. Okay. Revelation chapter 13, verse 16. And he calls it all, both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond, to receive a mark in their right hand or in their foreheads. And that no man might buy or sell, save he have the mark or the number of the beast or the number of his name. And that's the, the, the microchip, the RFID chip, the NFC, NFC chip, okay, your G GPS tracker. Okay, they trying to make you uh, basically a guinea pig with a, a tracking device inside of you, man. And they tell you, oh, the, the way you take it out, you 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 squeeze it out as if squeeze it out as if you have a, a splinter in your in your in your in your hand. Once you, as soon as you put that piece of shit in your your hand, okay, you're a complete slave and guinea pig to this man's society and and the devil himself, man. Okay, you're you're basically a servant of Edom. Okay. And that no man might buy or sell. You can't buy from any grocery store, any supermarket, any wine shop, any liquor shop. Okay, you can't buy your drugs. You can't even um, shop online. Okay, you can't uh, uh, do the things you want to do. Okay, if you don't have that mark. Okay, you can't sell. You can't sell your merchandise. Okay, you can't pop up into the club. The club is gonna ask you. Let me see your. Let me. Uh, let me see your identification chip. Where's your identification chip? You know, you can't do the things you eat. Life, as you know, is going to change very suddenly, very soon, man. Okay? Um, And that no man might buy or sell, save he had the mark or the number of the beast or the number of the of his name. Here is wisdom. Let him not have understanding. Count the number of the beast, for it is the number of a man, and his number is 603 square 6, which is Karama, Chai Stai Sigma. Okay? And that's the in uh, the Hebrew in the Greek, <coughs> and here's the uh, here is your your punishment if you take that chip. Book of Revelation chapter fourteen, verse eight, and there follow another angel saying, "Babylon, it's fallen, it's fallen, that great that great city, that great city, what what uh you 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 devils call it this place, man." Okay, make America great again. Okay, Rome. This is the modern day Roman Empire. The elites are somewhere else while they watching this place getting taken out and trying to implement their their, their new world order. But the Lord's gonna uh, uh, stop your enterprise at the fullness of his sufficiency. The Most High shall let it rain upon him. Okay, so basically, the, the Most High made these devils to create these uh, uh, weaponry and all this military technology to destroy themselves these nuclear missiles and they, which they have in some museums and some places to basically create uh, create this devil to destroy itself man okay that's why it said um that's why the scriptures say um um I created the wicked for the day of evil man okay all right it says and then follow another angel saying Babylon is falling it's falling that you know you watch that life alert commercial uh, commercial, okay. I'm falling. I can't get up. You know this place can't get up anymore, man. Okay. Uh, um, how for her, man? She in pain. Okay. Babylon's falling. It's falling because she had made all nations drink the wine of her fornication. This place is full of fornication. Okay. And the third angel followed them, saying a loud voice. And I hope, you know, what I hope is that the Lord shut down all these uh, uh, uh next ho uh holidays that's coming up. There's just nothing but witchcraft, sorcery, and, and um, enchantments, man. Okay? Black magic. Okay? 
the Lord said, go not in the way of the heathen. Don't be dismayed at the signs of the heaven. Don't be dismayed at the signs of what the Lord is showing you in the sky. Okay, some of the uh, actions that's taking place upon earth with the earthquakes of the people, different uh, uh, riots is going to come. Famine, you know. Babylon has fallen and found that great city because she had made all nations drink the wine of her fornication. Wine of the wrath of her fornication. And the third angel followed them saying with a loud voice, If any man, any man, worship the beast in his image and receive his mark in his forehead or in his hand, the same shall drink the wrath. Verse 10, shall drink the wrath. What is the wrath of the Lord? That's fire, man. Okay? That's fire. That's the nuclear missiles. Okay? What? Wine, uh, same shall drink the wine of the wrath of the Most High, which is poured without mixture unto the cup of his anger, his indignation, and he shall be tormented, punishment, beaten on all sides. You watch that the movie Terminator with Sarah Connor, uh, you know, you know, melting away like a, a damn uh, white chocolate bar, you know, a bunch of rats over there, oh man, through, <laughs> which is without mixture unto the cup of his indignation and he shall be tormented with fire and brimstone in the presence of the holy angel in the presence of the land okay which is Yahweh and the only holy angel coming from an aerial point of view Yahweh is pissed off man okay he wants vengeance all right that's why he said vengeance belongs unto me he will recompense the Lord will fight our battles man okay we want out this place is fully polluted they geoengineering their sky and everything you know the animals, uh, you know, are distraught. They're crying, you know. Watch that one video with Coco. Uh, oh, man, man is stupid. <laughs> you know, the beast is even calling uh, uh, these devils stupid, man. You know, a bunch of dead fishes in the sea, you know. That's why That's why the Lord got to take this place out, man. This is that, that one dirty, that one uh, dirty draws on earth, man. Okay. Basically, the Lord, the Lord, uh, uh, take the whore clothes off, and she's running on, the, uh, running throughout the street naked and shit, man, trying to run for her judgment. Lord, the Lord said, uh, 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 these devils are a vagabond uh, and a fugitive on the run, man. Okay. You know, like that, the old, like that old Western cowboy, uh, um, steal from the liquor store, and he running, running, running with uh, two guns in his hand and starts shooting and shit, man. Okay. Wild Wild West. <laughs> All right. Now, we're going to end it. Um, looking for the book of Luke twenty one. Luke twenty one. Book of Luke chapter 21, verse 16. We're going to end it here. And ye shall be betrayed by both, betrayed both by parents and brethren. When you tell your parents, the, you know, you tell your parents the truth, they, 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 you know, they betray you, man. But this is ultimately coming in the from the heavens saying that it's going to be literal, man. Okay, because they're going to sell you out. Okay, all the, he, my son was on the corner uh, teaching like a madman with his garment on and all that, you know. Basically selling, her, selling you out to the, the authorities, okay? But you got to stand steadfast for the truth. Stand, stand steadfast for Yahweh Shai as he did for the, uh, the his disciples and the elect of the nation of Israel, man. It says, And ye shall be betrayed by both parents and brethren, both by uh, parents and brethren, and kingfolks and friends, and some of you shall they cause to be put to death, and ye shall be hated of all men for my name's sake worldwide. News media. Okay, for who the sake, for the namesake of Yahweh Ba Shem Yahweh Shai, for Yahweh Shai's sake, because Yahweh Shai uh, uh, was the one who came here two thousand years ago in the, in the flesh. He was that word. Uh, 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 he was the word made flesh. Okay, as you can read in the book of John, First John. Okay, he was the he was the word uh, that that was made flesh. Okay. Um. So we're going to end it here. Watch ye therefore, verse 36. Watch ye therefore, let's start at verse 35. For as a snare shall it come on all of them that dwell upon the earth, on the face of the earth, whole earth, which is that uh that microchip, man. That's that snare that's going to come up on all the earth, 
Okay, so verse 36, watch ye therefore and pray always that ye may be accounted, account, accounted wor uh, uh, worthy to escape all these things that shall come to pass and to stand before the Son of Man. And in that, in the day, in the, in the daytime, he shall, he was teaching in the temple and at night he went out in a bond in the mount, the, in the mount that is called the Mount of Olives, and all the people came early in the morning to him in the temple for to hear him. And now they're hearing the elect. We we are teaching the people, okay, to watch and therefore and pray, man, okay. The the, 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 the sincere men, women, and children that come, uh, came back to the word of Yahweh Bashim Yahshua to shoot this living water, okay. So watch there, watch ye therefore and pray. All right. I really wanted to end with something else, but oh man. Um, I'm trying to grab it. Um, damn. I want to end with something else. It says, um, Let's end it with James 1 and uh, 2, and we're going to go on down to 4 and end it. My brethren, count it all joy when ye fall into diverse temptation, knowing this, that the trying of your pa faith worketh patience, but let patience have a perfect work. Ye may be perfect and, um, and enter wanting nothing. If any of you lack wisdom, let him ask Yahweh Bashim Yahshai. So pray for that wisdom, okay? Wisdom, knowledge, and understanding, okay? All things through the Most High, you know, it's possible, um, and that give it to all men liberal, liberally, and abrade not, and it shall be given. All right, but let him ask in faith, nothing wavering, for he that wavereth is like a wave of sea, sea driven with the wind and tossed. Okay. And verse se uh, verse seven, for let not the man think that he shall receive anything of the Lord of, of the Lord Yahweh should not shy. So. Pray for faith. Pray for wisdom. Okay, act for stability. Okay, as wisdom and knowledge should be the stability at times. It's according to the book of Isaiah, chapter thirty-three, verse six. You know, strength, salvation, the fear of Yahweh Hashem is the treasure. Okay, pray for wisdom and faith, man. Okay. Um. Wow. I really wanted something else, but damn. Alright, so let's end it here. It's, uh, it's 1 Peter chapter 2, verse 5. Ye are also ye also as lively stones are built up a spiritual house and holy priesthood to offer up spiritual sacrifices acceptable to God by uh Jesus Christ, who the who the world any called Jesus Christ, his name is his true name is Yahweh Shai Hamashiach. Alright. And who the world any called God, his name is Yahweh. Alright. So I hope this lesson was edifying. And then by giving all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Ba'ashim, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashim, Rakakadash. Double honors and respect go to the apostle and other great minister who will teach well. Peace, citation, to elect, teaching, and preaching, truth, and right experience. Sorry, I don't, I don't do that stuff, man. That's, that's sinning. Sorry. Um, Shalom, Akim, stay strong in spirit. We always out of here with the salvation of Yahweh Shai. Shalom.